Hey everyone, today I brought along a bag of My Little Ponies that I found at Goodwill. I paid $4.99 for the bag, and I haven't went through them yet, so I figured I would go through them with you guys. I, I don't know a great deal about My Little Pony, but I do know a little bit. So we'll see what we find, and anything that I may not know, and you know, we'll, let me know down in the comments. Okay, let's open it up. Right now, I know that we are on series or uh, generation five of the My Little Pony, and that generation started in 2022. So there's probably not going to be any generation five in here. It looks like there may be some one, one or two, and mostly generation four. Okay, I'm not sure who this one is, but they have fireworks on their tush, it looks like. Nope, flowers. Pretty flowers. This is a generation four. And this one has a chewed up paw. And this is a rainbow dash. And looks like this one's a generation four too. This one is a pinky pie. And this is the thing you Kind of see, you see a lot when you're picking up Brifton. is some that are very chewed up or things like that. But this is Pinkie Pie, and she's a generation four. And she's not any good. And this is Rarity. She's also a generation four. There's her tush and her face. And you can tell she's a generation four because of her face. The generation threes have a longer face, more like a pony face. And this is a dragon pony. I'm pretty sure this is a Generation 4 as well. Not sure who this one is. She's got little flowers on her tush. She's a generation four. So if you know who she is, let me know down in the comments. This one is Applejack, and she's a Generation 4. She's got apples on her tush. There she is. This one's not a My Little Pony. 
I don't believe. If you know what this one is, let me know. I'm pretty sure she's not a My Little Pony, though. My Little Pony's feet always look like this. They have the My Little Pony logo on them. And then one has a hole in it. This one is an older one. It's got a tooth. So I think that this would be a generation two, but it could also be a generation one. I'm not certain. This is another older one. And it's got a duck on the tush. She's got some markings on her, so she they be cleaned up really bad. And this one is another Applejack. Another generation four. And here's another one of this one. And then the rest are all smaller. We have this very small spike figure. And then we have one that's just a little bit bigger and he's wearing a bow tie. Here's this one. That's a generation four. She probably came out of a, a figure package that had several figures in it. And this one is really bad. I think this one's water shy. There's her tush. And then Rarity. Smaller ones usually come in figure packages or brown packages. And last but not least, I'm not sure who this one is, but she looks like a Generation 4. I think most of them were Generation 4s, except for, except for this one here. This one beside her, over here. Those were generation ones or twos. So there they are. 
And you might ask, is it worth it for $4.99? They need their hair clean. They need their bodies clean. And some of them you cannot save unless you want to paint them or something. But I think that even if you get three ponies out of it that are good, it's worth $4.99. I'm just not sure why they don't throw away the chewed ones because really children shouldn't have chewed toys. So wouldn't it be better just to throw them away? But they still include them in the packages. But other than that, I think it was worth it. This is probably my favorite. No, it so should probably be a lot of your favorites. I do like her a lot too, though. And it's neat to see the Generation 1 ponies, Generation 1 twos. But that's all of them. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up So if you want to see more of these kind of videos. And make sure you subscribe and hit that notif notification button so that you're notified of more of these kind of videos. Thanks for joining me, guys. Bye.